I'm here with the annual Shine and Dines MC, Melissa Doyle. How are we? Sophie, I'm really well. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I must admit, I'm a little bit starstruck. <laughs> I must admit. So this is uh, quite amazing. Tell me, being um, a part of Make-A-Wish is really, really important to you. Um, I've heard you speak about it. What, what is it about the charity that you're so drawn to? I think it's the simplicity. You know, we're talking about gorgeous little children that are fighting a life-threatening illness. And sometimes all they need to kind of give them that lovely sense of hope and strength is something as simple as a cubby house in the backyard or, or a puppy or, or seeing some penguins or, you know, sometimes the wishes are just so lovely and sweet and simple. And I think if we can make a difference in the lives of these beautiful little kids who are going through hell, I mean, you know, surgery, chemotherapy, whatever it is that they might be enduring and we can give them, I think the wonderful lovely thing is that between the granting of the wish and then actually going through with it, they've got something to hang on to. Yeah. So I feel really privileged that we can do that. And me too, I mean I've been a part of this event for three years and I, I have to keep coming back. I think yeah. once you're sort of a part of it and anchored, you can't help but want to be involved. Now you're a national patron of Make-A-Wish, so what does that actually mean and what does that mean for you as a role? For me it means spreading the word essentially, telling as many people as I can about Make-A-Wish, doing as many stories as I can as a journalist through whatever medium and just getting people involved. I think just educating and telling them what we can do. We've all got a role that we can play somehow or other and you know, trying to get everyone on board. Fantastic. Now you are the MC so you have a very important job. Uh, I'm sure you get a little bit of downtime. Uh, is there anything that you're looking forward to this evening? Oh, well. Specifically. Oh, I'm actually enjoying being decked out in my diamonds. Yes. Uh, that's, that's pretty fantastic, I've got to say. Yes. Um, I think just hearing the stories, you know, and hearing from Brooke, beautiful ballerina, and meeting Olivia and what oh. it meant to her. And really? it's hearing the stories. I don't think you can ever walk away from listening to those and not be deeply touched. So that's the highlight for me. Oh, completely. So look, on behalf of the annual Shine and Dine, on behalf of Sharon, thank you so much for being here. Thanks Thank you for, for giving me a little me. bit of time because I know you're a busy woman this oh, evening. How good are you? You're the best journalist. You're awesome. <laughs> Did you hear that? That was on camera. <laughs> Melissa Doyle said I'm a great journalist. That's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right, go to your dinner. Fantastic. Oh.